The redeemed Christian Church of God, City of David Parish, Victoria Island, played host to family, friends and colleagues who have come to pay their last respect to Adegbo Yega Oluma de Shoyongo, who was until his death the Deputy Chief of Staff to Governor Babajide Songwulu. Members of the King's College Alumni Association rendered the school anthem in honor of a worthy member. At the farewell service tagged Celebration of Life, Pastor Dakbo Akinoshu, who prayed that God grants the departed eternal rest and joins the people to live a life of selfless service, exemplifying Jesus in their day-to-day -day activities. Anyone that feels offended or felt offended, it is not because he did not want to do. It was just because circumstances at that time did not permit him. It is my prayer. That even as we rejoice and celebrate him today, we remember him for the good and the tough love. I... Governor Babajide Sonwolu, in a short remark at the event, described his late deputy chief of staff as the engine room of his administration, whose death has now created a big vacuum. He implored the Shonyongwo family to take solace in God that Boyega lived a good life. Being a legacy of selflessness and of profound commitment to the greater good what I think we has left behind. And his legacy will continue to inspire us, will continue to guide us and remind us of the power of life of dedicated service to humanity. The wife of the deceased, Yewan De Lendina, thoughts publicly for the first time, eulogized her late husband, delivering an emotional tribute, describing him as the most dependable partner anyone could ever ask for. My God. As your wife, and I'm saying it before God Almighty, I bless the day I met you. I bless the womb that brought you forth. I bless the children that God gave us. Oh. Everyone that matters to me matters to Boyega. If you're my friend, you became Boyega's friend. And for the people that I don't like, Boyega to enjoy sides with me. You cannot fight with his wife. Adegbo Yega popularly called GS, was born on the 3rd of October 1968 and died on 15th May 2024 after a brief illness at the age of 55. He survived by wife and children. The family opted for a private interment after the farewell service. Aditola Kayode, LTV News.